Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Thursday, 19th of October 2023. These trades were shared by AA who is trading Nasdaq CFT. As you see, the macro chart here is in downtrend and we can see on the structural chart that it broke the consolidation area and the complex pullback here and the sellers came back. And you can see also that in the trading chart. So using the smaller trading chart, we identified this area of sell short entry based on algo 1 to 5 and entered and managed and closed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by MG who is trading Dow Jones CFD. As you see the macro chart is in wide range sideways and now the price has the point of control and going down and you can see the downtrend channel in the structural chart. So this downtrend channel was identified. So he used a smaller trading chart and took several sell short entries based on algo 1 to 5 with setup T and entered and managed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by KZ who is trading S&P 500 CFD. As you see the macro chart broke this level of the sideways and the price is going down and you can see the downtrend channel in the structural chart and it gained momentum. So using one minute trading chart he identified several area of pullback and entered and managed this using exit strategy number one with profit. So thank you KZ for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Yasin who is trading S&P 500 futures. As you see the macro chart reached the area of static support and the price strongly bounced back. So when the price broke up this level on the structural chart, he identified the uptrend using the smaller trading chart and entered several long positions using algo 1 to 5 and set up T and managed and closed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you Yasin for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Sam or Global Instructor from Australia who is trading Nasdaq CFT. As you see the price on the macro chart shows that on this candle the price got rejected and the buyers came back. And on the 5 minute structural chart you can see that there was a strong support and every time the price got rejected. So this is suitable for setup D. So he entered multiple positions with good average price and risk to reward ratio and manage and close them on the other side of the channel with profit. And here is the result of his trades for the day. So thank you Sam for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan or Global Instructor who is trading Nasdaq CFT. As you see the macro chart shows that the price broke down this wedge pattern and you can see in the structural chart the downtrend that happened. So using one minute trading chart, he identified multiple area of sell short entry based on algo 1 to 5 and entered with setup T and managed and closed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Thursday, 19th of October 2023. These trades were taken on Nasdaq, Dow Jones, and S&P 500 futures. If you look at the one hour macro chart, we see that the price was fluctuating around the previous day close and low and retesting these levels few times during the Asian and London session. And it was a narrow range waiting for the Fed chairman speech and Therefore, the market volatility was high and we can see that during the New York market session that was within the same range going up and down with high volatility. So initially when the market opened, it went up, retested this level of the value area high and resistance and came down to past the previous day close. And again, by it came back around 1140 and brought the price higher and again to the same level. So this wave of uptrend that started from 11.30 was good to take long position on NASDAQ and you can see with setup T multiple entries were taken here and also on Dow Jones you can see entry and exit and S&P 500 around the same time. 
So all these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts. And the result was positive, showing a profit factor of 30 with 91% win rate, mostly from the long positions taken. And the average win to loss ratio of 2.84. The largest winning trade was 160 and the largest losing trade was $54. So I hope this trade taken by the past system is useful for you. And let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.